This I wanna nail sports to the one Top blog out of the YouTube channel No matter which sports here we got it covered Subscribe and hit the notification bell Hey what's up sports to the bone family Welcome back to another video Hope everybody is doing okay now my viewers and subscribers It's indeed a pleasure to bring you guys another video even though I am late. All right, so let's get straight to it. Now, yesterday we, we, we actually took a look at the first day's auction, IPL auction. We looked at a couple of West Indian players that were selected. So we're going to be zooming in on the second and final day. A couple more West Indians were picked up. So now we know all the West Indian players that will be participating and we are now aware of the ones that were not selected whether they listed their their base price too high or people just didn't fancy the, fancy them you know whatever the case is we are now aware of all the west indian players that will be participating so i'm just gonna go through it quickly and call out a couple of names my viewers and subscribers so before i go any further you don't know we are looking to grow the channel so just continue to hit that subscribe button if you have not yet subscribed turn on the post notification bell leave a like and drop a comment all right so yesterday we saw the lights of nicholas puran jason holder shemran hit maya you know and guys like those um going and and doing bravo so we're going to be zooming in on uh the the the, the final set of guys that were snapped up and i must say that i am indeed happy that these guys got the opportunity because at the end of the day my viewers and subscribers we want these guys to go and apply their trades of their trade overseas so that they can pick up some cash you know all right so we see we see people like um romario shepherd yes man going going out um yeah romario shepherd he was picked up talking about 7.75 crores so romario shepherd sold to the sunrise of hyderabad so yeah man he will be expected to do some work for them based on his all-round um capabilities so he's there we also had odin smith yes man odin smith is another man that would have um would have uh come on to the radar lot of team actually taking a look at him he went to the punjab kings you know so odin smith goes to the punjab kings six crores so he's he goes uh who else we have we have um uh i think kyle myers yes my viewers and subscribers kyle myers he was picked up by by one of the new teams thing is luck no i think the new team the new team is called so kyle myers he will be looking to do some work for them happy to see him getting an opportunity you know when west indies had him in test in test we were wondering why they don't give him a chance in the white ball cricket well see a team pick him up don't know don't know you know some of these guys probably won't get a chance to play any game but it is a payday for them and they will definitely be working in the nets they will be working in and around some other top professional players so they will definitely pull them up so very good to see kyle myers getting picked up uh fabian allen is another man that was picked up he actually got picked up by the mumbai indians yes man so fabian allen goes to the mumbai indians he will definitely be looking to continue his good work over there in the ipl he will be looking to um to to, to contribute both with bat and ball he would have proven that you know he's definitely um a man that they can invest in and they'll probably get good returns on their investment uh ravman powell yes man he, he is an next man that you know we we are happy to see him getting another opportunity he would have done some work on the t20 and t10 circuit and you know he would have raised a lot of eyebrows and teams would have definitely started paying attention to him especially after getting that century the other day you know getting such a, a, a brilliant um century goes to show that all right he is still capable and you know teams can invest yeah i mean if he goes to the ipl they're probably going to have to start do some bowling don't know if they're going to deploy him as a top as a top order batsman or is or if he's going to be asked to play as a finisher and to do some bowling he was picked up um for 2.8 crore by the by the delhi capitals you know so shemran hit team of last year picked up um ravman powell so 
Coyle is another West Indian that will be looking to, to, to do his thing. Dominic Drakes, also my viewers and subscribers, he was picked up. And he was picked up by I think it was one of those new 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 franchise new teams that just coming in. So good to see him. Oh yes, my viewers and subscribers almost slipped me. I think um Sheffield Rutherford was also picked up. So I am definitely going to do a video covering all the West Indies players that were selected. But as it relates to day two of the the auction, I think those are the ones that I can remember as of right now. Uh, well, let me give you some information here. Not a West Indian, but, you know, Jaffa Archer. He was actually picked up by the Mumbai Indians. And the reason I am pointing him out is because, you know, we, we, we definitely have some amount of interest in Archer's career. Uh, not, not, we're not owning him or, or, or we're not trying to take him, you know, but we are always happy when we see him doing well. He was picked up by, the, I think it was the Mumbai Indians that um, shelled out some money for him or on him. Uh, Alzari Joseph, uh, so I think was picked up, yeah. I think that's a base price, uh, Alzari Joseph. Uh, which team? I think, uh, yeah, man, Alzari Joseph got picked up, man. Mm -hmm. So Alzari Joseph getting another another run in the IPL. You know, remember the first time he played for Mumbai Indians, he did very well until he was hit. He was hit really badly, and then you know he, he basically fell down. And for some reason, West Indies don't really give him much opportunity in T Twenty cricket, you know. But you know, we are hoping that things will work out for him there. So Alzar Joseph will get an opportunity to do his thing. And um, I, I have the top 10 players here that, you know, um, they, that they would say the top buys. They are the top buys. Yeah, man. And Nicholas Puran features on there. So, you know, let me see. You now we have Ishan Kishan. He actually was the, was the top man. He went to Mumbai Indians. Then we have Deepak Chahar. Went to uh, Chennai Super Kings. Uh, Sharius Iyer, he went to Calcutta Knight Riders. Liam Livingstone went to the Punjab Kings. Um, Takor went to Delhi Capitals. Hashal Patel, he did extremely well in the last in, in last um was it was it was it um the last IPL that he, he, he did he did okay? Uh, trying to remember. Well he he went to the Royal Challengers um Bangalore. Um Hasaranga. Another mis uh, mystery spinner that a lot of teams probably would have wanted. He went to the Royal Challengers Bangalore. Nicholas Puran coming in on that list, going to the Sunrise of Hyderabad. Lucky, Lucky Ferguson going to the Titans. And we have um, uh, Krishan, Krishana went to, uh, who is this now? Rajasthan Royals. And um, a next guy, Avish Khan. He went to the Super Giants. So those are the guys that um, that went for big money. So Nicholas Puran right among the mix. I don't know. And I guess they see a lot of potential input. Well, we know the potential is there. But um, we were a bit worried, especially after how his, his, his last year, his last um, IPL, IPL went. You know, things didn't really work out too well for him. And I was thinking that, you know, it might be a bit tough for him. I was thinking that a team would pick him up, you know, but I was a bit worried that, you know, things might not definitely be as smooth as you would have expected. So those are, are the West Indian players that I can remember off the top of my head that were, were snapped up on, on, um, on the second and final day. So I think I did part one yesterday. So... You know, just giving you guys part two, even though it's behind the auction. So that is part two. So, you know, a couple of guys that weren't picked up, people like Evan Lewis, people like um, Akil Hussein, Darren Bravo, uh, a couple more guys listed themselves. But, you know, no team was actually interested, so they weren't picked up. So, you know, that is basically how it goes, my viewers and subscribers. We have to give them, um, we, we just have to give them all the support. And just hope they will go out there and get the business done. Because at the end of the day, they are all West Indian. And, you know, you don't know how long of a career you are going to have. So if you are able to get it, then take it. <laughs> yeah. So we're going to leave this one right here for now, my viewers and subscribers. Sports to the bone. Keeping you informed. Please remember to like, share, leave us a comment. If you have not yet subscribed, please go right ahead and subscribe to the channel. I'm out.